So I decided to test this theory because I noticed a few weeks back, I noticed somebody did a video on Leonard Skinner and their name had changed to, from being spelled with A's, Lin Lineard Skynard, which is how I used to pronounce it. I mean, we knew that's not how it was pronounced, but that's how it was spelled. So I was like, hey, anyone want to listen to some Lineard Skynard? And when I found out those turned to Y's, that kind of tripped me out a little bit. It was a little bizarre to me. And so when I thought of this theory, I decided to, uh, the first band I thought of, of course, was the Leonard Skinner because it just changed. I just seen it changed. And so I thought, well, hell, the most famous Freebird. That's the most famous Leonard Skinner song, right? And I checked it. And... I'm listening to it, and and this bird you cannot change. Oh, and the bird you cannot, the bird you cannot change. I just remember, and this bird you cannot change over and over. And those sounded pretty bizarre. So I'm going to post some links. And uh, one of them is Molly Hatchet, a pretty dang famous band. I got Will Ferrell, and you have to skip pretty far ahead in that. And he's not a singer, but he's pretty famous. And he must have a bad memory, just like me, because he says, and this bird you cannot change as well. And there's several there. And then I've even got Leonard Skinner themselves live performing it and this bird you cannot change and this bird you cannot change now i mean go check the bands that's names change the some famous songs that you know or see if any of those lyrics changed i know i'm going to in the coming in the coming days